A major earthquake has struck the coast of central Chile. The 7.1 quake was centered about 70 kilometers northwest of Temuco, and this is the same area hit by a destructive 8.8 .8 magnitude quake that was last February. There are no immediate reports of damage from the latest quake, and authorities say there doesn't appear to be a risk of a widespread tsunami. But eyewitnesses did describe the quake as loud and strong and say people ran into the streets when it hit. Patrick Depolonio joins us now via Skype to tell us what he experienced. He's in Vilcún, Chile, which is about 20 kilometers from Timuco. I know that you have felt other earthquakes before. How did this compare? Well, it's quite uh, different to the others happening in the last quarter of uh, the year 2010, but very harder for, for another one. What did you actually experience? You were, you were in your house? Where were you and what happened? Yeah, I was in my home. Uh, as you say, it's uh, around 20 kilometers behind from uh, Timuco and around 60 or 70 from the epicenter in a small city called Bilkun. Uh, it was uh, started moving slowly at the first moment, but then it's going harder and faster. And then actually the things in my home started moving like in the last earthquake and uh, shutting down actually, like the electricity and uh, some other service like water and, and uh, fuel, actually everything. I'm sure it scared a lot of people. Did anybody run into the streets or did people run for cover? How were other people reacting? Well, cities like Puerto Saavedra, the people started moving to the hills where actually with the cooperation of Carabineros de Chile, our police, uh, some people actually started to go to the full stops to fold their phones. All of this because the government said there will be more replicas. One of that was one hour ago and uh, then minutes after the big one, uh, uh, so the other replicas will be happening uh, actually along of this day. Villarica and Spucón cities confirms at uh, through Twitter that some uh, full stops are empty and principally because the fear that the citizens are feeling. All right, Patrick, thanks uh, for bringing us into the picture and telling us how it felt uh, on the ground.